Hey, oh my god, I hate saying hi. Hi guys, welcome to today's vlog. If you're new, welcome. So I've been living at my parents' house in Long Island for the past five months, and I am finally moving back to my studio apartment in New York City, officially full time. So I came in yesterday on my boyfriend's U-Haul because he's moving out of the city. So I brought my stuff in on his U-Haul, helped him move out yesterday. And then we went for dinner and drinks outside with two of our other friends from high school. And it was just really nice to have a sense of normalcy. The city was really quiet for a Saturday night. It was honestly sad. We just sat at dinner all night, which was great. We had margaritas. I only had two margaritas, but of all of quarantine, I've never, that was like super exciting for me. <laughs> <laughs> I've barely gone out to dinner, so just a lot for my system. I've been like really healthy and kind to my body over quarantine. So yeah, I'm just, I'm a little tired. Okay, we have a lot to do. I have to unpack everything. I have so many packages of stuff from the container store. My sister is dropping off her two puppies for the week, so I am puppy sitting while she goes out to her boyfriend's family house. We have two hours until the puppies come. I want to like put a sheet on my couch because it's velvet. It picks up their shed so quickly. So I have to do that all before the puppies come. Let's make the to-do list really quickly and then I will go get coffee and bagel. So all of this stuff, a new hamper, all my pantry items that I've collected at my parents that they're not gonna eat, a whole suitcase of clothes and such. I did a container store run with my parents at some point. We have some packages still over there that I haven't opened. I have to get groceries because even just last night at dinner, I spent like 40 something dollars on drinks and food. The city is just so expensive and I, I need to grocery shop. So let's get our list together. So far we have unpacked my suitcase that I brought, put sheet over couch so that the dogs don't get it all shetty, changed my duvet cover for the same reason, just because it's a pretty nice one from West Elm and it's white, so even if they, they're not going to pee in the bed, they're really well trained, but I just want to be super careful even just with the shedding. Get all my packages from the package room, there's so much. Grocery shop, clean the fridge, which I really need to do before I even grocery shop because it's still a situation in there. Feed the dogs at nighttime and walk them at nighttime. But first things first, let's go get a bagel. <laughs> We're back. It was torrential downpouring. So I grabbed Starbucks next door and the bagel place next door was closed. So I have to order, which really sucks. I don't know, ma'am. Let's order a bagel. In the meantime, the dogs are coming at like soon. So I feel like priority is like setting up the couch and my bed to be puppy proofed and getting my packages so that I can get their food ready. And then when they're here, I can focus on unpacking and everything else I have to do for myself. But I feel like puppy prep first. First things first, put my diffuser on, obviously. So let's set the vibe. And then I'm going to fix up my place. I think let's go with the eucalyptus today. not expensive at all from Urban Outfitters. Aren't you tired of the drama? You use your words like they are knives. I don't need that type of drama and trying to be tough for the day time. Yourself feel better by taking me down Once I fell, but now I'm strong I'm ready for the rematch Shoot me down, don't you know I get up Yeah, baby, I will fight No, there ain't nothing stopping me I lost the bedding thing I lost them I think I found them what are you looking at me so cold? One's love is now we're enemies. You try to make yourself feel better by taking me down. 
once I fell, but now I'm strong, I'm ready. Okay, I for sure did it the wrong way. Like, I'm pretty sure you know the shorter corners don't match the longer corners, if that makes any sense. However, I finished it. I don't care. The dogs are going to come and just ruin it anyway. So I'm going to clean this mess up and then decide if I want to cover my couch with a sheet or a blanket. And honestly, this timing's perfect because my food will come when I'm done with this. And then I just have to get their food, but like realistically, it's okay if I get that at a later point today. Okay. Gas ladder. Did anyone else learn this song from Jojo and Jordan from The Bad Thread, or is it just me? I feel like I did a good job. This is definitely obviously like more secure, but also since it's too big for it, it might be less secure and end up popping out. I don't know. Cause this looks pretty snug, right? Let's, let's head over to the to-do list real quick though. Cause we got some things done before my bagel even arrived. If I can get all the dog stuff done before the bagel arrives, I will be so happy. We put a sheet over the couch. Hell yeah, we did. Change the to duvet cover. Mm, that's it. But look at the video my sister just sent me. Leo, are you gonna be with Aunt Jenny? Leo, are you gonna be with Aunt Jenny? <sighs> nope, not my thongs, Leo. <laughs> Leo. <laughs> so that's what I'll be dealing with this week. I'll just have to hide my thongs, I guess. Okay, going to get the packages. Yeah, baby, I will find okay, I only grabbed the Chewy box and the Lauren's own blow journal and some mail. And I will get the rest of the container store stuff when I do an organization vlog. But today is like, I need to mainly unpack and get the dog prep. Let's see what we got from Chewy. I just did a whole unboxing and it didn't film. So here we go again. We got some biscuits, some bones that are gonna stink up my apartment that they love. Some chicken, duck, and chicken liver bones that are also gonna stink up my apartment and reduced fat food. I'm officially prepped and ready to be a dog mom for the week, clearly, because I'm already on my hands and knees. You know what this means, right? It means a deep cleaning vlog is coming your way. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go take this out and hopefully my bagel's here any minute. Now the ETA of my bagel is 12.07, because the order was delayed at the merchant. I just wanted a bagel, I'm in New York, it should take two seconds. The good thing is, I actually paid a lot, because I got a lox bagel, and with delivery and everything, it was like, $15 for a freaking bagel, but I kept, I tried every app, I tried different stores, and like, it was just always expensive, and I really wanted blocks. So the good thing is it's at 12, so it'll be a, my breakfast and lunch, so I won't have to pay for lunch. Oh, it's still pouring. As of now, it looks like I might be doing a grocery shop like early tomorrow morning. We shall see. Also, great, I'm gonna be holding two dogs. How am I gonna hold an umbrella? This is just... Okay, let's unbox Lauren's journal. It's from Lauren Doan herself. Oh, why am I gonna show you guys addresses? I'm not. Okay, comes like this. So if you guys were debating getting it for when she restocks, look how cute. Thank you with the sticker. I like, don't wanna touch it. It's really, really cute. I've been so excited about this. I'm going to make this bullet journal like my holy grail of lists, so. I know it says today's to-dos, but I'm gonna do, it's hard to find bullet journals that are also spiral. So this is actually perfect for what I've been looking for. I'm gonna do like a wish, a home wish list because there's always things that I need. I still haven't gotten a rug, which is why it's so echoey in here. Like just random things. I'm just constantly redoing my apartment, not redoing, but like constantly needing things and wanting to change things. So I'm gonna make like a home wish list. I'm gonna do like, goals for the month, just like really manifest the sh out of this bullet journal, so I'm really excited. There's not that many pages in it, so I don't even know if I'm gonna keep doing my to-dos in here. It might just be like a manifest, we'll see, we'll see. But here it is. Now I'm gonna insta-story it, and hopefully my bagel comes soon. I'm gonna hang out now and open some mail.
Okay, my sister just left. She gave me the load on, down on everything, but now I can finally eat my bagel. Here are the puppies. Say hi, Olive. Say hi, Leo. It's been a few hours since I last spoke to you. I've honestly been just sitting on the couch since I ate my bagel, watching TV, FaceTiming my best friend while we make our grocery lists together. However, it is a Sunday at 4.30 and I really don't want to be stuck on a Trader Joe's line waiting outside to get in when it might rain. Ugh, it just sounds awful. As much as I want to get my grocery shopping done today, I feel like waking up early tomorrow would just be way smarter in terms of like waiting in line and stock and everything. So I'm gonna do that. All I wanna do is sit on my couch. I don't wanna unpack or anything. You try to make yourself feel better by taking me down. Okay, my boyfriend gave me all these mason jars and a cheese grater. So I'm very excited mainly about the mason jars. Put these in the wash. Leah, get out of the way. Okay. We're really getting things done. That's gonna be one of my upcoming vlogs because I just did a whole container store haul. So I'm gonna do that for you guys in a few days, go through everything I bought and implement it all. Do a little home haul. I got these Purely Elizabeth Collagen Protein Oats for when I'm really in a rush. They're so easy, you just pour milk or water in, put them in the microwave, and these actually come with a nut butter packet. These are gonna be really great when we go back into the office come January. So diagonal, but you're in my shelf. I got these also the same with just the original superfood oats. Then I have my Saqqara teas. I have a whole thing of chia seeds for my oatmeal. And then just a bunch more of like cacao powder and flax seeds and things like that. So I'm gonna put that all away, go get my packages, and then in the morning we're gonna do a Trader Joe's haul. You know what I just realized I'm gonna do? I'm gonna set alarms, because I'm not used to having a dog and I really don't wanna forget to feed them even though I'm sure they won't let me forget. I think I should set an alarm on my phone because sometimes I get carried away at work and I just will forget to walk the midday too. Hello. Hello. What a cute big room. She'll only kiss me if you guys aren't looking. Ready? She won't. Oh, she will. She will. <laughs> Okay, I am embarrassed. <laughs> I didn't even get my container store stuff yet. This is just the Amazon stuff. So, we're gonna open these Amazon packages, get into my to-do list, and then we will do the container store haul another day. This is wide open, what's this one? Oh, this is exciting. Rise Brewing Company sent me their new cold brew lattes. Oh, this is so exciting. We have to do a taste test in the morning. Oh my God, they weren't even supposed to send me this too. They sent me a whole box of oat milk, of their new organic oat milk. That is so nice. Oh my God, I have so much oat milk now, I'm so excited. Oh my God, does anyone else get this excited over oat milk? Probably not. Okay, this I'm excited for. These are the pens that Lauren Doan recommends that she uses for her bullet journal. So obviously Lauren Doan gets these pens, I get these pens. Mean Girls reference, anyone? So we can bullet journal later. There's just so much to do, so much content. Okay, exciting. Oh, what is this? I think this is my laptop stand, which is great. Okay, we will figure this out in a sec. Okay, there's instructions, we're good. Gas ladder, you broke it. Oh my God, this is from Rise too. Okay, I see what the situation is. They send it through Amazon. So here I'm thinking I went on an Amazon binge, but it's all from Rise. 
Okay, this is what I was really excited about. They have a new London Fog Oat Milk Latte, so it's an Earl Grey Tea Nitro Oat Milk Latte. I could not be more excited. Thrilled. Thrilled. Oh, this is part of my organization home, but I got these shelf dividers for the closet shelves. Okay, cool. This is a... B. Oh, easy enough. Cool beans. Okay. I even need of a shower, so this is where I'm going to end the vlog. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. Please don't forget to subscribe. Olive would love it, and I would love it, and we want to build this amazing community. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. It really helps me out and the algorithm, and comment down below. Comment down below, because I answer every single comment, and I love chatting with you guys. Stay healthy. Mwah.